behalf of the entire Cleveland Orchestra family, the musicians, board of trustees, staff and volunteers, it is my great pleasure to welcome you to this 43rd annual Martin Luther King Jr. Celebration Concert. I would like to take a moment to thank KeyBank, our community access partner. KeyBank has been the generous underwriting sponsor of the Cleveland Orchestra's annual MLK concert since 2005. Our thanks to the bank for its long-standing partnership. It is now my great pleasure to welcome to the stage the mayor of the city of Cleveland, the Honorable Justin Bibb. Thank you, Andre. Good evening. evening. Now, y'all can do better than that. Good evening. Good evening. It is so great to be here. My first MLK celebration as the mayor of this great city. Thank you. And this, this event is special to me because my grandparents, when they came up here from the segregated South, the first church they joined was Core United Methodist Church, where this celebration started. And so I want to also just acknowledge the amazing community heroes we're going to celebrate here this evening. You all represent the best of our great city as well, too. And in closing, I want to just remind you of something that's very important. Tomorrow is not a day off. I'm going to say it again. Tomorrow is not a day off. It's a day on. It's a day on. It's, it's a day on for us to remember what King calls us to do. We all have greatness inside of us. And we all, not just government, but each and every one of you have a role to play to make sure that the moral arc of this universe is bent towards justice every single day. So. Let's keep fighting, let's keep voting, and let's be an example to the next generation because they're counting on each and every one of us. Thank you so much. Let's keep the dream alive. Thank you, Mayor Baird, for such uh, inspiring comments. Isn't it great to have a mayor who's such a great speaker? For the past 17 years, the Cleveland Orchestra, in collaboration with the City of Cleveland, has honored individuals and organizations who impact the community in the spirit of Dr. King's ideals. Here to present this year's Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Community Service Awards is Jeffrey Weaver, Orchestra Trustee and Chair of our Board's Community Engagement Committee. Joining Mr. Weaver are Cleveland City Councilman Kevin Conwell, who established this award, and Cuyahoga County Councilwoman Yvonne Conwell. Please welcome them. Good evening. Thank you, Andre. It's an honor to present the Cleveland Orchestra's 2023 Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Community Service Awards this evening to three very deserving recipients. First, we recognize Ms. LeJean Ray. Jean is very popular this evening. <laughs> and she's also a dynamic director of the Fatima Family Center. <laughs> the Fatima Family Center provides critical services to over 6,000 families in Cleveland's Huff neighborhood. Emergency and transition services, 
services to children and families, and services to older adults. Ms. Ray was appointed director in 1996, and under her leadership has significantly expanded the center's services and working partnerships with area businesses, schools, and civic organizations. And there's more. In 2000, the Fatima Center was recognized by Annie E. Cassie Foundation as one of the top five family centers in the United States. <laughs> Regine is an accomplished leader and relationship builder, a strategic thinker, and a visionary. You see, it's when she shows the kids a world beyond the huff by taking the high schoolers to Africa or on the annual visits to college campuses. That's pretty impressive. Or when the pandemic hit, Regine installed Wi-Fi in the sitter's parking lot and gave her senior adults Chromebooks, internet access, and a safe way to connect others, not to mention drive-by hot meals. Or when Regine forged positive relationships between neighborhood children and police officers. You know, Dr. King said, life's most persistent and urgent question is, what are you doing for others? And we can see from what Regina is doing for others, she's doing it every day. Every day. Congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations for the impact that you've had, the lives you've changed, the beloved community you've created. We are honored to present you with this Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Community Service Award. Dr. William Henry Caldwell. A familiar face indeed to many of you. He's attended these concerts, those who have attended these concerts over the years will recognize Dr. Caldwell. He's been a resident conductor of the Martin Luther King Jr. Celebration Chorus since 2003. Over that period, he's been an integral member of the Cleveland Orchestra family, assembling and preparing the chorus for performances with the Cleveland Orchestra at Severance Hall and beyond. Each year, Dr. Caldwell prepares about 150 volunteer choristers of all ages and from ranges of musical background. <laughs> ranges of musical background for the Cleveland Orchestra's MLK concert, selecting repertoire and shaping the chorus to perform music that touches our soul. Dr. Caldwell has prepared courses for the Cincinnati Symphony, the Cincinnati Pops, and May Festival, and for Indianapolis Pops among others, and serves as a resident conductor for the Cincinnati Symphony Classical Roots and Community Mass Choir. And during a 34-year tenure as professor of music at Central State University, <laughs> Dr. Caldwell serves as conductor of the Grammy-nominated Central State University Chorus and has directed several recordings for the Telerec label. Congratulations, Dr. Caldwell, for uniting so many communities in song and for especially for being the Cleveland Orchestra's treasured artistic collaborator for more than 20 years. It is indeed my personal honor to present you with the Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Community Service Award.
one more. <laughs> and last, but not certainly least, we honor our Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Celebration Chorus. After year, the glorious Martin Luther King Jr. Celebration Chorus lifts to the collective voice and affirmation of Dr. King's vision of justice, peace, and human harmony. The chorus was first assembled in 1989 to sing as part of the annual MLK Celebration Concert held originally at Quarry United Methodist Church from 1989 to 2000. Choristers from, church, from the church's gospel choirs across Northeast Ohio were assembled by community organizers and especially chorus director Alvin Paris, who led what was then known as the Community Gospel Chorus until 2002. Now known as the MLK Celebration Chorus, it's, it's been led by Dr. Henry William Caldwell, and it served from, who has served from 2000 to now. This volunteer chorus is more than an ensemble of talented, dedicated choristers from throughout Greater Cleveland. They are a positive, devoted, and caring community, many of whom have sung in chorus for more than 20 years, each performance in joyful reunion. So I say now, Congratulations to the Martin Luther King Jr. Celebration Chorus for blessing us each year with your collective voice in celebration of the spirit and ideas of Dr. King. We are proud to honor you with this Martin Luther King Jr. Community Service Award. Some proud moments indeed. So please join me in giving all of our honorees another round of applause. And now, <laughs> now without further ado, please join, enjoy the evening and have a great day.